Hi, everyone. Um, really proud of our team this weekend. Uh, uh, obviously a little shorthanded, and uh, I thought we played great in, in both games, um, and, and our energy was great. Uh, the way we attacked, um, attacked the net was great. Uh, overall, I just, I just really liked our team. I thought Maddie played well today. She made a couple of huge saves in the first period that I think um, gave our players uh, a little bit of, uh, you know, felt like they could they could go play and it was okay to make a mistake here or there because uh, Maddie was playing really well back there. So overall, I thought it was a good weekend for us, really good weekend for us, especially after last weekend. Obviously, all around great offensive performance, but one thing it seemed to me was that your team didn't always necessarily look as comfortable on the power play. Um, as they did in other parts of the game. What do you think about the performances in the power play? Yeah, um, you know, when you're throwing a little curveball in the middle of the week, it's hard to uh, work with, uh, you know, work on it too, too much. So, you know, hopefully we'll get back into the rhythm where we can work on it a little bit more. But um, I thought for, for the most part, they uh, we, we did okay. Um, but we need to capitalize on those opportunities more, right? Um, you know, and, and that's something that uh, will certainly be a focus for us uh, moving into next weekend. And, and uh, you know, we got to we got to make sure we clean that up a little bit. And, and uh, you know, you got to you get an opportunity on a man down and you got to you got to take advantage of it. Coach, overall, how were you uh, how, what were your thoughts about this weekend with your team, especially after last weekend being so close against Providence and, and just taking those adjustments that you said you would work on and seeing what the team was able to do this week? I thought it was great. Um, you know, you, you last weekend was not our best weekend. We know that, right? And and uh, to be able to come back um, uh, the way we did, I, I just was really impressed. Uh, you know, we have a fairly young team, and uh, I think the way they responded from last weekend to this weekend with the craziness of the week, um, I just really thought they did a good job. Can you talk a little bit about Kelly and her play this weekend and how, how she's really kind of put the team on her back um, just as a leader and leading by example on the ice, off the ice? Yeah, I, I think, uh, I mean, Kelly Brown, she's a really good hockey player, obviously. She uh, plays the game. Uh, she plays a 200-foot game, um, and I thought – one of the most, one of the, the better goals was, uh, I think it was Savannah's that second goal. Um, I mean, Kelly Brown worked her tail. No, actually, it might have been the one that she ended up scoring, but she worked her tail off there um, in that second period and, and uh, just kept her uh, uh, competing with the other team. And that helped her get, end up getting, I think she ended up scoring it or maybe stabbed it. I don't know which one, but, um, and, and she just competes every day. Every day, every zone, no matter where you're, where, where you're, uh, where you are, uh, you know what Kelly Brown's going to give you, and that's why she is such a good leader. She's, she's, uh, she just does things the right way, and and uh, I love seeing her. Obviously, um, you know, work so well and help our team win. Uh, she's always trying to do that, right? Um, so I was, I was really happy with Kelly. I got one more for you, Coach. You got Northeastern next weekend on the schedule. They're number two in the country. How do you prepare for a team like that, given? The circumstances yeah you know they haven't played yet so it's not like we have a lot of video on them uh they'll i guess have a little bit on us but um but uh you know they're they're obviously a really good hockey team we know that um and i think uh we need to continue to, to compete in every every shift that we're we're out there and uh you know we'll see what happens i think it it will be a great weekend for us and and uh you know um you know, it's a big opportunity for our team to, to play against a team uh, that is number two and, and uh, that is a very good hockey team. And you really get to see where you're at in the first half of the year. So uh, it's uh, I'm excited to see it. Hey, Kelly, a big game, big weekend, especially for you. What were you seeing out on the ice this weekend and what made it so successful for you and the team? Yeah, I mean, we were down a couple of players this week. So I think my main goal was just going in, um, giving everything I had, competing every shift, you know, just doing my best to like lead by example and uh, bring some energy for the team to have us come out with two wins this weekend. Kelly, what can you say about uh, Maddie's performance in that? Like, what, is it, what does it mean for you to be trying to score and then see your goalie coming up with like, those incredible saves over and over? Yeah, it's huge for us. Um, brought us a ton of momentum, and she made a huge save on a 2-on-0. 
and that was huge. We needed that, and she kept us in the game. She made a ton of key saves, so it was awesome having her back there making those big saves for us. Kelly, before before the game, we saw Abby, uh, Abigail, you know, doing some TikToks in the camera. Uh, you guys seem to have a lot of fun before the games, after the games, and during the games. Can you just speak a little bit about the chemistry, especially having such a young team? Yeah, um, all of us are really close, um, all best friends, so it's awesome. We love to joke around and have a great time, keep things light, uh, nothing too serious. So we just try and have the most fun we can all the time. I got one more, Kelly. You got Northeastern next weekend. I know you're going to celebrate these wins this weekend, but how do, you, how do you prepare for a team like Northeastern, knowing what they bring to the table, especially this year? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're a great team, and I think just we got to build off this week, you know, keep improving on what we've been doing well and um, working on things we have to improve on. So um, big week of, oh, excuse me, big week of practice coming up. So I'm excited to see how we compete against them next weekend.